Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to Chef Big Cuisine. Today, we're making chocolate chip cookies. Now, in my humble opinion, this is the best chocolate chip cookie recipe ever. These things melt in your mouth. And thank me later when you try them yourself. So, let's get started. All right, so for the ingredients, you're gonna need two and a quarter cup of all-purpose flour, one teaspoon of baking soda, one and a half teaspoons of cornstarch, half a teaspoon of salt, three fourths cup of unsalted butter that you're gonna melt and allow it to slightly cool, three fourths cup of packed light or dark brown sugar, Half a cup of granulated white sugar. One large egg plus one egg yolk, and both of them at room temperature. Two teaspoons of pure vanilla extract. And finally, one and a quarter cup of milk chocolate chips, or if you prefer, chocolate chunks. All right, so to get things started, you're gonna to want to whisk together the flour, the baking soda, the cornstarch, and the salt, all together in a large mixing bowl until it's all well combined and you wanna set that aside. That's gonna be your dry ingredient. Make sure to smash that like button, share this video, and subscribe to this channel. And stay tuned until the end of this video for a sneak peek of what's coming next week. Now separately in a medium sized bowl, you want to combine the melted butter, the brown sugar, and the granulated white sugar all together and whisk it until no lumps remain. Following that, you want to whisk in the egg and the additional egg yolk. Once that's well combined, finally whisk in the vanilla extract. All of this combined will create your wet ingredients. So now what you want to do is pour the wet ingredients into the dry ingredients and mix them all together with a large rubber spatula or you can do so in a stand mixer with a quick attachment. Now the dough will be very soft yet thick. And while you're preparing your dry and wet ingredients, you can go ahead and preheat your oven to 325 degrees Fahrenheit or 163 degrees Celsius. And additionally, line two large baking sheets with parchment paper or silicone baking mats. And now after you create the dough, you wanna fold in the chocolate chips. So this is the end result you're looking for for your dough. So a secret to creating soft and chewy cookies is to actually stack the dough balls instead of making them round. And so what I mean by this is you're gonna take about three tablespoons of dough for each cookie. And if you wanna make smaller cookies, you can use one to two tablespoons for the dough balls. Now what you wanna do is roll the cookie dough balls to be taller rather than wider like cylinders. This will make your cookies bake thick instead of becoming too thin. And you wanna place at least eight cylinders of dough onto each cookie sheet. If you have an extra long sheet, you can fit more. And you can also press a few more chocolate chips or chunks on top of the dough ball for aesthetics, only if you desire. So you want to bake these cookies at 325 degrees Fahrenheit or 163 degrees Celsius for 11 minutes. And the cookies, once they come out of the oven, will look very soft and almost underbaked once removed. They will continue to bake on the cookie sheet, so allow them to cool on the sheet for 10 minutes before transferring them to a wire rack to cool completely. And to give the cookies a more natural look, just press down on the cookies to flatten them while they're cooling. 
And depending on the size of the cookie you make, you can either have a serving of a dozen to two dozen chocolate chip cookies. And just like that, you made your very own chewy chocolate chip cookies. Now, in my humble opinion, this is the best chocolate chip cookie recipe ever. And you'll thank me later after trying some of these. They literally melt in your mouth and they're going to be gone before you know it. As always, this recipe and many more can be found in my cookbook, Chef Vic Cuisine, Volume 1, Finding Your Inner Chef. That's available on Amazon, and I'll be sure to leave the link to that in the description box. Oh, and here's a tip for these cookies. Um, after the first day of baking, you can always reheat them in the microwave for about 10 seconds to make them super chewy and they melt in your mouth. Thank you all for watching and don't forget to smash that like button, share this video, and subscribe to this channel. And stay tuned for next week where I show you how to make this amazing, delicious macaroni and tuna salad. So I'll see you next week on another episode of Chef Vic Cuisine. And until then, peace.